Sabina and today I'm so delightful because we are having a champion here, our star. Guess who? Best footballer of the year untuk musim 2022-2023 adalah William Plum dari PSM Makassar. Selamat, selamat, selamat. Yes, let's welcome William Ian Plum or better known as Plum. Hi Plum, how are you? Uh, fine, thank you, thank you. Very good. Good. Oh, wow, I'm sitting here at the champion. Um, firstly, I'd like to congr congratulate you because winning on the league finally after five years. Yeah. Thank How you. do you feel? Uh, very happy, of course. Uh, few times close. Few times uh, close. Finally, we have it. So, of course, very happy. Very happy. Very happy. Yeah. What about your team? Everybody happy. Everybody, happy. Everybody <laughs> amazing. Uh, atmosphere very great, of course. Okay. Cool. Uh, what do you think the most important factor on winning this league? Um, yeah, there are a few factors, but uh, first of all, the, the team itself. Uh, and then I not only talk about players, but also the staff, the kit man, everybody involved in here. It uh, was a pleasure this whole season to, to work with everybody. And uh, I think that's also the power of our team, that we are uh, so a very compact team. Yeah. And uh, of course the supporters, uh, supporters, we did not lose one game in home, in Pare Pare, so yeah, more, more factors, but uh, all together uh, give us this. Together, yes, solidarity, yeah. Yeah. and yes, the supporter exactly. too. Uh, uh, how do you stay perform, although you are not that young, you are 34 years old this year, am I correct? Yeah, you're correct, yeah. yeah. May we know what? How? The tips? No. To keep perform? No, no, no tips. It's just the same, like, I don't know. It's the same for me, like always. Of course, you get older. Um, maybe a little bit slower. Slower? I don't know, but that's normally what happens when people get older. Uh, but no, no. Same like always. And uh, nothing changed for me. Age is also just a number. Just a number. Just a number. So. Note that. Yeah. How long have you been played to pass at Makassar? Um, this was my seventh year. Seven years. So now I'm here seven years. Wow. Yeah. Seven years is quite a long time. Yeah. And I'm seeing you remain loyal to PSM. May we know why? What makes you uh, loyal to PSM? Because I see you on another interview that back then uh, you're, you don't want to move to another club unless it is Barcelona. Is that right? No, that's not right. There are more clubs, of course, in Europe. But uh, no, I, I, I have it good here. I'm happy here. Uh, I'm happy here. I also know situations that it's not so good. So let's say I have it good and I want to keep it good. So okay. and that's what I have here. So no need to change for me. Uh, so you still haven't think of moving to another club without... Uh, what about moving to another country? like being a citizen here in Indonesia. Do you ever think of that? Uh, I thought of it. <laughs> we spoke about it. Uh, but in the end, we decided that uh, after my football, we want to go back to Holland and, uh, and um, live there. Also because of our families and oh, yeah. things like this. So yeah, we would love to stay here. Uh, we love to stay in Bali. My family lives there oh, now. Yeah. So it's an amazing place for for foreign people to live, yes. uh, kind of a dream life. But uh, yeah, I think it's better for the for my kids and oh. for my families to to go back to Holland. Okay. Um, okay. In what year do you think of? I have a <laughs> two more year contract. Oh yeah. And when that finished, I uh, I stopped playing football. Oh yeah. That's so sad. Uh, what's yeah. the most great experience you had as a player in Indonesia? What is the thing you like and the things you dislike uh, being an Indonesian player? Uh, this is a question I, I, I was thinking about already <laughs> a long time. Um, well, first, what I like, of course, is, is, is the supporters. It's supporters. The, yeah. the, the ambience of the football here is, is, is quite big. Uh, maybe the level is not the same as in Europe, but 
everything around the level is is, is similar or bigger. Um, that's very nice. Um, of course, the for me, especially me, the traveling, seeing traveling. seeing all the country. Yeah. So I've been to places where I would never come in my life normally. So that's a nice thing. Uh, bad things are uh, also a lot, but uh, ah, political things, things yeah. that are happening lately. I think that's very bad, very bad for the Indonesian football, very yeah. bad for the people here. Uh, of course, also back to the supporters again. They bring a lot of good things, yeah. but uh, there are also a lot of things happen that is, uh, is not good and also need to change. Uh, but I think they know themselves, and then I think everybody in Indonesia should try to uh, to think to think a little bit more sometimes yeah. at the emotional moments to Where? to behave better. But okay, uh, there are things that can improve, and uh, I hope it will improve for Indonesia. Hopefully, is there uh, any difference about supporters in Indonesia and Holland? Yeah, <laughs> there is a lot. Um, it's a lot. Nah, yeah, especially what I said, the, the, the emotion of the people, nah. in one way it's very nice, but if it's go the, ro the wrong way... It's going to be boomerang. Yeah, <laughs> exactly, and that's... Uh, yeah, I think if they can change that or manage to keep the emotion under control, yeah. yeah, then this country, for the football, for the supporters, everything will be amazing. Okay. Plum, if you were not a footballer, what do you think you had become? I don't want to think about that question. You're uh, going to retire, you said. Yeah, but I was a footballer. Um, maybe coach? Maybe coach, yeah. I will, I, will, I, will to, I will go to get my licenses, of course. Okay. But I don't know if I... You still want to have a career in football? Uh, also, that I'm, I'm not sure. I'm also not sure at what level I want to be coach and stuff. It's, uh, we will see after. Okay. But opportunities come by and, and uh, yeah, and how far we, far we can get in this. Okay, last but not least, mention five qualities that footballers must have for young footballers or your uh, colleague. I'm not a... five is a lot. I think I learned from one uh, old coach of mine is saying don't improve, don't try to get better in what you are not good at, but try to improve what you're already good at. Okay. So try to become specialist in things you are good Just at. Like. So yeah, of course it's good to be a total player, but that's for not for many, okay. many players uh, there. Okay. All right, Plum, thank you so much for your time. Yeah. Wishing you Godspeed. Thank you very much. Bye.